Hello YouTube, welcome back campaigners. This is Campaign Terrain, and I am your host, That Guy Cross. If you've been following along for the last few videos, you notice that I built these city blocks. I built some roads to go with them. I also built some bridges. In this instance, I'm going to show you how to build these railings that go along with the roads and blocks so that you little guys don't fall off. These are purely for aesthetics, but they can use, be used for a different number of different purposes. They can be used as the railings. They can also be used simply as walls, and you can also use them as crenellations on the side of a castle if you were building a larger build. They can be modified in lots of ways. These that I'll be show building for you today are made out of XPS foam. That's the building insulation foam, the standard styrene. They can also be built out of a sandwich of foam core, which is also a type of XPS, and that's this one right here. They can be built out of EPS, which is, oops, I'm sorry, I had that wrong. That's this one. I can be, they can be built out of EPS, which is packaging material, the stuff with all the little white beads. They come out just fine, and you can use pretty much what any material you want. These are made with EVA, that's the, the rubber floor mat foam, and this one is made out of cardboard, clad in Pack, food packaging and it, it comes out really sturdy and really heavy but man it took me a while to build it now all of these are all single material this one is built out of a combination of the insulation the uh, excuse me the packaging material and the top is a layer of the foam core uh, that's been peeled so you can build them any number of ways you can build three inch wide to make them fit the three inch grade. You can build them six, nine. This one happens to be 12, so I can use it as a solid wall. Lots of different options for you today. So I hope that you come along, maybe uh, get some insp inspiration from these and figure out 10 or 12 different ways for you to make them and for you to use them. And I would love to see those pictures. So there's gonna be some links over here. They're probably already up. Click those during this bump. And right after the bump, I'm gonna show you how to do these things. Thanks for coming to Campaign Train. My name is Cross. And I want to show you how to do these in just a second. Thank you for coming.
there you go. Pretty simple build. Hope it wasn't too boring for you. Hope you learned some techniques. I hope you build a bunch of these and bring back and show me the pictures. I would love to see those. Now, I only showed you the one type, but they can be used to make all of these different kinds, different sizes, different materials. You can build them however you want, make them whatever color you want. They don't have to look like bricks. You can make them look like cobblestone. You can make them be solid walls. Now, I will admit, these do have a couple of things that even I'm going to modify on my next patches. Uh, for example, if they're in a narrow passage, like a three inch wide passage, they butt up against each other and little figures can't walk between. So if you've got a narrow alleyway with rails all along the side, it's going to be a little difficult. So I'm going to have to try to figure out a way to weight the bottom so they don't tip over. For example, you can make them without these buttresses sticking out where it's just a straight wall. That might work better with a slightly thicker piece of foam. Now that's still gonna take up some of the alley, but at least your figure could probably get through there. So there's any number of ways that these could be modified, tweaked, added to, make the railings taller, make them wider, any number of things. I hope that this has inspired you to go build some more, create a whole city for yourself. Thank you for coming. This is Campaign Terrain. I'm your host, Cross. I love you guys. And until next time, I wish you luck in your campaign. Stick around for the beauty shots right after this bump. Thank you.